briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1914, the Supreme Court heard Houston East and West Texas Railway Company v. United States, a case that challenged the act to regulate commerce, which aimed to prevent carriers from discriminating against certain traffic based on its origin or destination. At the center of the case were three railway companies that were charging higher rates for shipping from Shreveport, Louisiana to Texas compared to shipping from Texas to Shreveport for the same distance. This resulted in a complaint claiming that the carriers maintained unreasonable rates and unjustly discriminated against similar traffic between Louisiana and Texas. After testimonies and arguments were heard, the Interstate Commerce Commission ordered the carriers to adjust their rates to eliminate the discrimination against interstate commerce. The carriers challenged this decision, but it was upheld by both the Commerce Court and the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court ruled that the Commission had the power to correct unreasonable discrimination against interstate commerce due to the relationship between intrastate and interstate rate relations. Carriers were required to eliminate discriminatory practices, even without lowering interstate rates. This decision, which was upheld by the Commerce Court and Supreme Court, aimed to resolve conflicts between state and federal views in favor of the freedom of interstate commerce. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.